Hi everyone, I'm Jenna Chapman and welcome to my channel. My videos include beauty how-tos and vlogs of my daily life. I will leave all information in the description box down below. If you like my videos, can you please give them a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hi everyone, welcome back. So today's video is going to be about testing a product that's new out on the market. Um, basically going to be doing a review on it, seeing if it works, if it doesn't, and just my general opinions of the product. Um, so, do you want to know what the product is? Drum roll please. The product is... The Bondi Sands Self Tan Razor. I don't know why I'm just patting it. I'm so excited to try this. So for any of you that actually self tan out there, you know how much of a pain in the bum it can be to get tan off before you reapply a new layer or a new coat or a fresh tan. So this product is supposed to change the way we self tan forever. And I, for one, am absolutely so excited to test this out. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply this product um, as per the directions. Um, and then I'll come back and show you what my skin looks like afterwards. I might even insert a few photos. Um, and then what I'm going to do is put on another tan tonight and then remove some of that tomorrow. Um, and see how it works on a fresh tan as well. So this product was just released um, like yesterday I got it. So um, it says for best results apply Bondi Sand Self Tan Eraser to dry skin after at least three days of applying self tan. So the tan that I have on now has probably been on for maybe about four or five days. So it's getting to the point where it is really quite patchy and it's to the point where you need to kind of scrub and scrub and scrub to get it off before you apply a new tan. So hopefully this product is going to take all that scrubbing out for me. Um, step two, it says pump foam applicator firmly and apply Bondi Sand self tan eraser liberally to the skin. Leave the self tan eraser on the skin for at least five minutes. And then step three is shower with warm water using a wet face cloth to wipe away the tan. For more stubborn areas or dry skin, use the Bondi Sands exfoliating mitt to gently remove the tan. So that's what I'm going to go do now. Hey guys, I'm back. So, the verdict is in. I love, 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 love this product. It is, it is absolutely amazing. Like, so, so good. Um, so, I'm actually getting ready to go to bed now. Um, I'm going to put another tan on tonight. Um, and then I'll test it out tomorrow on a fresh tan and see how it works. So the self tan eraser um, is the same consistency as the Bondi Sands um, dark tanning mousse, the foam. Uh, the only difference is it's obviously like white in colour, but it has the same kind of texture and consistency as the tanning um, product. Um, when I put it onto my skin, I thought it was actually going to be a bit like creamy and it would, you know, sit on top of the skin. It didn't do that at all. It soaked into the skin. Um, and not long after you rubbed it into the skin, it pretty much you couldn't even see it on there. It was invisible. It just it absorbed into the skin pretty well. Um, yeah, left it on for the five minutes, then went and had a shower. Then I just used a face cloth and rubbed it all over my arms and wherever I had the um, tan residue on there. And it pretty much just wiped away. Like, I can't even believe how much it disappeared. It's insane. I'll definitely be using this product again. I think it's fantastic. I love it. Just amazing. So worth the money. Go and buy it. So yeah, I'm going to go put a um, coat of tan on now and go to bed. And then when I wake up in the morning, I'll, I'm not going to remove all of it. Otherwise it defeats the purpose of putting tan on. But I'm going to remove um, parts of it and see how it works with tan that's like a fresh, fresh. 
refreshy. Good night and I'll see you all in the morning. Morning everyone. So I removed my tan yesterday as you all know and then I reapplied um, a fresh coat of the Bondi Sands liquid gold last night. Um, and then this morning when I got up, I used the Bondi Sands um, tan eraser on that fresh tan to see how it perform on a fresh tan versus a three day old tan. So it definitely did erase a uh, majority of the tan. It did fade it. It didn't take it away completely. But in saying that, the product isn't designed to be used on a fresh tan anyway. It's designed to be used on tan that's three days old. So on my tan that was three days old, it was absolutely amazing. Like I can't even describe how good it is and how much it's gonna make my life so much easier. Um, and then in the tan that was, you know, a fresh tan, it definitely did fade it. It just didn't completely take it away, which let's be real. You're putting a tan on, you want it there. You're not really gonna be wanting to take it away anyway. So um, overall opinion on the product, this product here, it is seriously amazing. Like, it doesn't disappoint. It will change your life in, in terms of how you do your fake tan routine. Honestly, it is the best. Definitely, definitely recommend it. So I will also insert some pictures of what my tan was like before and then after. That was yesterday's tan. Um, and then I'll insert some pictures of my tan before and after um, this morning as well for the fresh tan. So yeah, like I said, overall product is on point. Definitely recommend it. Thank you all for watching please if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and I want you all to remember that you are beautiful you are loved so just do you until next time catch ya